We are up to mitzvah number four, which is it is a positive positive commandment to fear Hashem, as it says, "Et Hashem elokecha tir'eh." You shall fear Hashem your God. The way to towards revering and fearing God is like the way to love Him, as outlined in the previous mitzvah. When a sin comes to one's hand, we have an obligation to arouse this inner conscience, our inner spirit to know that the Holy One, blesses He, is watching every action of us, and to have a conscience, and to fear God and revere Him. And there's two types of fear. Fear that God is going to punish us, but the higher level that we should all aspire to is... The Zohar says we should fear Hashem, not because He's going to punish us, because He's so awesome and powerful and unlimited. Begin the Ihu Rav Vishalit. Hashem is almighty and all powerful. And how could us mere mortals even think about not following Him? Because we, it's out of respect, not because He's going to punish us, because we hold Him in such high esteem. And we should know that the Zohar says any mitzvah that does not have b'dechilu urchimu, 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 love of God and fear of God, we have to serve God with all our heart and all our might. Each mitzvah needs these two ingredients. We have to love Him with all our heart and fear Him with all our heart. This is a commandment that applies every second. It's a constant commandment. Included in this is not to say God's name in vain. It applies to men and women equally.